Here's a nice little tip for uh, cleaning RF connectors, specifically uh, N and BNC type connectors. These are called micro brushes. You can get 10 of them for $2 at a Hobby Lobby. They're normally used for applying uh, paints and adhesives to uh, like uh, plastic models. Um, there's two main sizes, uh, super fine and fine. Um, the super fine you can use for like an like a SMAs or a SMBs or MCXs, you know, those little smaller RF connectors. But for uh, regular RF connectors, you want to stick with the fine. It's the yellow color when you see it. Um, you start by dipping them in a denatured alcohol. Avoid uh, rubbing alcohol because they add like glycerin and stuff to it. And just sort of uh, stick it in the center conductor of the uh, RF connector like this. Run it in, in and out sometime, a couple times like this. Same thing on the BNC. Gets them really clean. And then when it gets full of crud like that, the tip there, you can use it to clean the inner shell. Run it around there a couple times. It helps to get away any dirt and stuff. Now, to clean the outer shell, there's a stuff called Never Dull from Ego One. You can find it in a automotive supply places. It's uh, a wadding polish, which means it's uh, they embed the uh, cleaner inside like a cotton wad. Rip off a little bit of it. Like so, and you can use it to. Uh, clean the body of the RF connector like just this. Um, it's really handy. It'll remove like uh, adhesive left over from tape and even a coax seal. If you ever had a coax seal on the RF connector, you know it's impossible to get off. But you can just use a little bit of this stuff and it'll basically come right off. I guess it really clean. Um, it does leave a bit of a film. So you'll have to use a just use a paper towel to uh, Wipe it down after you get done polishing it, but it uh, works out really good. Um, don't let it get near plastic, like most cleaners, it'll dull plastics, but that's uh, it's not a problem usually.